Well, hello guys. Today, Peepaw, Cookie, and Callie and I, we're walking a 5K. And we are participating in the one here at Smith Mountain Lake for the Walk to End Poverty. It's an annual event that um, all the local Christian charities and also businesses around the lake support. So come on and let's go see the highlights of the day. Let's go. So many people walk with their dogs. There's just dogs everywhere. So this is a dog friendly event. And if you're in the area and you're interested in supporting some charity work, then it's great. And we're here at the state park and the rangers are here and they have some display tables and um, they've got some informational stuff too. following the event they are cooking hot dogs so please take a moment and stop and have a hot dog before you leave we also will be doing the team announcements of the team that raised the most money and the one that had the most walkers and runners here today so stop back by and get a hot dog and team announcements um, i do tell i want to let you know as you're going up through the course you'll stay to the right you will have some traffic up on the course area, not in the beach area, so you need to stay to the right. On the way back, you will go to the left, okay? Runners go first. When I sound this horn, the runners go first, and then any any 10K walkers will follow. All right, ready, set? Whoa! Oh, I got it. doesn't matter. 10K walkers! Ready, set, go. All right, everybody else. You need a place. My name is Colin. The two pack is 170. Yep. Well, Callie and I are at the back of the pack, but you know what? I don't mind it because now I've got all of the pretty scenery and some quiet and some exercise. This is a really nice state park, although there isn't any um, overnight parking in this part. They have a separate campground but they have swim beaches, they have nice boat docks. It's pretty nice stuff. Get over here. Get over here, stay over here, come on. There you go, good job. So there's already some of the runners coming back. They're doing pretty good time. And they've got the path signs up, marked very well. And then right here, we walk right past where the boat ramp is, but what's great is there's bathrooms like there, pretty much like about five different locations along the, the trail. And they, it's a pretty good setup here. Not only can you do these kinds of things here, but there are hiking trails back over in here that come along that we've done before and we've ridden our bikes here a lot. So it's a great place to do a lot of outdoor hiking and walking and biking. And Cookie and Callie have been having fun. We got Cookie's wearing a hat because she has cataracts and in the bright sun, it glares on her and she can't see. But with her hat, she does great. Watch her go. This place is hopping with everybody out getting exercise. They do a good job where they list the partners on signs all the way up and down the route. 
and uh, they were telling us that this year well actually for the last couple of years their charitable funding has steadily decreased while their needs that people have have gone up by about 90 percent and the park is still open like they told us so people are doing really good about going slow around all the walkers because everybody's kind of spread across the road so as we head back she gets in the lead the other times she always is walking behind me so she knows when we're heading back she's happy Good, good. Hello friends and thanks for giving us your time and please drop us a comment because we just love getting those but more importantly keep going out and exploring life matters. We hope to see you again soon. Bye bye.